What is going on guys? Coming at you very late at night with a quick um, fall fishing, primarily musky fishing report. Uh, we might throw a fish catch in somewhere right here. Um, but basically, you know, I've been on the flow pretty re frequently the last couple weeks doing a lot of musky trolling. Um, I've also done some sucker fishing, you can check out a video of that somewhere in the end of this video. Um, but uh, yeah, I mean, fishing's been good. Um, you know, it had to work. Do we have one? We... False alarm, we don't have one. Um, but yeah, we've been doing quite a bit in that 8 to 12 foot zone trolling. Um, you know, it's been a pretty decent bite. Do we have one now? Let's see. Yes, that's a fish for sure. We're hooked up. Um, but yeah, fishing's been good. We've been fishing quite a... We haven't not been doing very well in like the 15 to 17 foot zone yet. Um, trolling anyways. Maybe the sucker fishing guys have or have had success there. I have not. Um, but it, it really seems like the bite's just kind of scattered right now, you know, which isn't that much of a surprise considering we have water temps ranging from like 52 to 55 degrees across the lake. Um, these fish are still moving into fall locations and just because the water's not really cold yet, they're not fully there. Now with the cold, he's really jumping back there. Um, but now with the cold really coming in, tomorrow's the first day it's really going to set in. Looks like we have about a week straight of highs in the 40s, lows in the teens or 20s with possible snow. How awesome is that? That's what I like to hear. Um, but yeah, a lot of these fish are going to get pushed to their um, you know, later, late fall locations, more deep water, more concentrated, and that does that's a nice fish. We'll take that all fall long. Um, but that doesn't just go for muskies. Um, these same things apply for smallmouth, walleyes, crappies, a lot of things that I have not yet touched on all fall. Um, so that's my goal after nice this week one. to do more multi-species fishing. Um, get back to you know show you guys a lot of other opportunities that exist in the Hayward area because I feel like it's kind of weird. I see more boats fishing for anything but musky all summer long here, but in awesome. the fall, all anybody ever thinks of, to fish for up here, it seems like it's musky Sweet. and it really doesn't get a lot of Sweet, hype, man. especially late in the fall really for musky or anything else. And there's a lot of opportunities to catch big fish, all species, in the Hayward, Wisconsin area, late in the year. Very untapped um, potential that I don't see a lot of guys capitalizing on. Probably because most of you guys are up in a tree. Um, but anyways, that's kind of my hope to get out there and do you know a little bit more exploring and uh, showcase some of the great opportunity we have here. Um, Absolutely check out the Treelands Fall Musky Bash. It's something that myself and a few other guides have put together. Very informational, very fun weekend. I'm hopefully going to have a hype video out for that in a couple days here if I have time to sit on a computer or can bear to sit on a computer anymore um, in the next week. But uh, yeah, that'll be the first week in November. Um, you know, like I said, very fun, very informational weekend. Not a fishing tournament. We're going to be in raffles. Treelands is doing um, a great job of getting you guys a deal on lodging there. Um, the only order of business would be that the lake is getting kind of low if you're not familiar with the flowage. Um, it's not hard to navigate around at all. You just got to pay attention. Uh, the lake's about two and a half feet down right now. I have not had a problem pulling my boat in and or out of the lake. Um, if you guys are curious about that, I don't really foresee it being that big of an issue. Um, but we'll see. Um, so anyways, check that out. I'll throw some information about that down in the description as well. And as always... Subscribe to this channel, watch this video, this video, or this video, and stay tuned for more in the near future.